so the idea of the practice was something that was more open and that's why it was called studio as a place a place to work and to share uh, mumbai was just a way to locate where the studio was physically set in uh, but for me the main main basis of that was that it allowed for a space where we could explore thoughts and ideas you know and 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 possibilities you know through a sort of very diverse group of people so we have uh, you know young architects uh, we have someone uh, we have you know i have artisans who are carpenters and masons we have this lady who's you know who who study textile who's part of the studio i have a few people that come from a fine arts background you know and have nothing really to do with architecture in that sense they're artists in 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 a sense of training uh and then we have uh you know i have a colorist who joins me from time to time there's a you know someone that works with with light and and with glass you know as in you know blown glass so the studio in some way also expands and contracts depending on the work that's happening depending on the research that is not necessarily project related you know uh in some ways it's more like an art practice more than an architectural one one of the things that i that's important is that in everything that we do we have the potential to in some way and i mean, you want to use the word impregnate you know where you 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 place something in the project that you know the physicality of the project might go but you always leave something behind you know which enables another culture another civilization another possibility to overlay on that and take you know and use it as a as a life source as a place to nourish what we don't know yet for me that's how i am able to uh participate in the world that we live in you know i think these are choices that have to be made and i don't think that what i do is going to change the world or i've not done it with the idea that it's that to change the world uh, i think it's just that what we're doing is to show a possibility you know the exhibition that you see here in stuttgart uh it is a fragment of our studio you know uh but in some way encompasses the diversity of the studio in terms of the people involved materials involved uh thought processes you know ideas uh it's a lab that uh that you're walking into